The following video is rated PG-13, which may contain scenes and themes unsuitable for people under the age of 13. Close each day, home in no way. Nearly killed Rigby. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. All right. I'm sorry. You are the same whiny bitch that you were when you found out that Watt had the hots for me. And Buchu! That's enough! It was all my fault! What is? The crash! Everything is about to be broke at any minute, and I didn't know anything about it! I just don't know what to do with Ian anymore! We're gonna go to the forest and go camping. It's the perfect way to have one join together for a great day walk! Oh, I'm too young to do a fun shoot! I already need a shoe list to end! She'll get blown away by you posing in the forest? Stay with me, Sprig. Don't let go. I don't want to die. Help me. Grab my hand, Sprig. Help! Don't you want to help? Excuse me. Do you know where my kids are? Lost in the woods. Typical. They always play around at the woods only to get themselves lost. I mean, what's the... What the hell was that? Oh, hell! Colin, what happened? We need to help him. Hop up! He can't hold it for any longer! I can't swim! Please help me! I, I got you, dude. Just hold my hand. <laughs> it's okay! You're okay? You're fine? Are you alright? I... I can't feel anything. I can't feel my legs at all! We need to get him to the hospital. I'll drive! Oh, you're back. How was the camp? It was fine, I guess. Except, there's been an accident with Sprig. What? Is he okay? He's alright. Except he has got a broken leg. Great. Just what we missed. Another day of someone getting hurt. Everything that someone goes through is a death trap. Sure. How can Sprig fall into a river and can't swim? That's just stupid. Not all frogs can swim. <laughs> Shoot up, Lou. It's not that funny. Indeed it wasn't. Oh, heck. At least we got Warner to save the day. He's a hero! Thank you for this remarkable story, Sylvia, but could we please get on with the memory reading already? I, I, got your word, sir. Dead. Yup, that's it. It just says dead and nothing else. The dumbest mem to ever exist on planet Earth. Kane, are you robbing a bleep bank? Nonsense, we are adventuring a bank pony, keep up. Shot a person. Breaking news, Kane has been arrested for robbery. And he may likely never be the ringmaster again. Me and Cootie C.H. Seeing the moon. Hello, Kane. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Welcome to Sherman City. The town is only for Fujitsu. Wait, what? <laughs> the Butterfinger Mysteries episode in Winners, The Depression. Oh my god, the Butterfinger Man is extremely super duper mega hyper depressed. The depression rate has increased to 100%. What just happened? Wait a minute. This isn't funny signs. You guys didn't have to request signs here. Oops, wrong show. 
<laughs> Voskov, if you try to make stupid excuses again. Excuse me, are you Cindy Jeffries? Oh, um, ah, uh, yeah, I am. And you are? Muriel Bag. Stints and I are close friends of Wanda and Sylvia. Oh, I see. What can I do for you? Do you remember our dog called Courage Dawson? Yeah, I do. We've only come to collect some of the secret things that Courage used to have before his suicide. I mean, I'm just utterly outraged by what Courage has done to all these people. Yeah, so am I. How the hell could our dog lead a drug syndicate and brainwash some people, like Malik and Finn? What he did was pure evil. I get what happened, but do you have any clear reason what kind of things you are after? The tape that Courage recorded. It was days before his suicide and he threatened to have Mella killed if he didn't return to the drugs. And also that letter that Courage wrote, and get this, he was still dead. That makes no sense. He must have wrote it while he's in the afterlife. Then how come that letter got here in the first place? You tell me. He must be revived. That's nonsense. Courage is still dead. He can't possibly wrote that. He's right. We have to investigate clearly on that letter. Cool of Fantastico. Welcome to the amazing digital circus. My name is Pomni, I'm your ringmaster, and I'm here to show you the most jaw-dropping, heart-stopping, mind-bending paraphernalia you've ever laid your eyes upon. Wait a minute. Most of these memes don't have photos at all. What is going on? I think Jim the mean guy must have broken the image system. God damn it, Jim. Okay, now this is getting weird. But how much weirder can this possibly get? He failed to get a girlfriend for the 326th time. This is what happened. Uh, oh. Talk about Valentine's Day gone dark. Congratulations, you have no girlfriend. Now go to your closet <laughs> 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 I did not say laugh, you idiots! Alabama governor signs law allowing church to have its own police force. So a church can have a police force now? I wonder what it'll be called. The Jesus Police? The Jesus Police? <laughs> Ninja golf? I didn't know ninjas go golfing. How do they go golfing? With katanas. Swords. Kaiju! Me, my 100 million 200 thousand 300 homework assignments. Holy shnikes. What kind of idiot would want to do all this homework at once? This is torture. I'll be 80 years old when I finish this shit. Steve Carell. The 90 year old virgin. Better late than never. Now at age 90, Steve Carell still doesn't want a wife. What? Are you gonna say something or you're just gonna stand there? Dude, just ignore her. She's gonna AFK. What's this? A video game? Shrug. No results for Shrug. Never mind. We found it. Oh wow, what an ironic software fail. On tonight's episode of Lose Stupid Life. Lou tries to recreate a cold opening scene from an episode of Yellow Bird Plays, but it turned out to be really cringe. I think Lou wants to follow in Chuck's footsteps. The other two kids are like, dude WTF is she doing? Coming soon on Curriculum Gaming, Lady Bird Lou Plays. Well, there is trouble in my mind. Just kidding. It will never happen. Leland and friends prepare to sacrifices to bring Patrick back from the dead by scattering a bunch of toys on the floor. That never works. My theory says so otherwise. Oh, shut up, will you? All right. That'll be enough, Lady Bird. Booty she am fishing for now. I think we deserve a break. Kaya. What are you doing? Looking for treasure. What else? It's fun doing this, especially this time of night. You can't just go treasure hunting in cold weather. What were you thinking? What is your problem? I always wanted to look for treasure. 
It's not a bad idea, is it? Wait, I think I found something. Please don't tell me there's money in it. Dear Kaya, Fang Nag, I sang Anak Ko. I know how deeply devastated you were when I died. I already lost Junjun since he's out overseas, but you and my wife will always be there for me. I already have a feeling that there's another terrible event that's gonna affect both of you, and I am not gonna let that happen. You must go back to the Philippines where we live. If you carry on staying in this city, it's going to make things more complicated than you ever think. Please, fulfill this wish for me. What is it? That's Amado's will. He wants to go back to the Philippines? What? Why would he ask us that? But wait, there's another letter I found. Kaya, I love you from the bottom of my heart. I have never stopped thinking about you from the first minute I saw you. I just want to meet you face to face and talk this through. Signed, Anonymous. Wait, your boyfriend wrote that? Who is your boyfriend? Mrs. Jeffries, that's me. There is something that has been delivered for you. Is this about Courage's letter? No, it's different. It's a letter from Forex. Oh, great. What do they want this time? Just read it. You know we belong together. Forever and ever No matter where you are You're my guiding star Hold me in your arms Don't let me go I want to stay forever Closer each day